are not only my wife, you are my best friend. You have taken on quite a lot since we met, helping me Helping me with Taylor and Aubrey. And now we have a beautiful son together. <laughs> and I can't thank you enough for everything that you do. You being a mother figure to Taylor and Aubrey is something that I have trouble explaining in words to you. But you have done an amazing job. I can't wait to grow old with you and have you by my side. You will always be my best friend, my wife, the person that I adore the most. I will always be there for you, be by your side and support you when times are tough. I love you. Kirk, when I met you I was shocked at how quickly and deeply I fell in love. I was completely smitten. It felt like every question I ever had about my life had been answered. You were and still are so warm and playful, funny and affectionate, a wonderful father and friend, honest about all of your feelings. I never would have thought I could love you more, but here we are, about to have our second wedding and my heart is busting at the seams. You have given me the most precious gifts of my life. You've made me a mother, given me a family, and together we have built a warm, loving home. It excites me to think about all the adventures we will have throughout our lives and brings me comfort to know I'll have you to lean on during the hard times. More than these words can even express today and for the rest of our lives. Your wife, Mrs. Tori Thomasy. I love Kirk because he is honest, supportive, and trustworthy. He is fun and playful and affectionate. He is loyal and always expressive of his love for me. He brings me little treats, which is always food, <laughs> when he goes to the store or any restaurant and tells me he loves me 25 times a day. I love Tori because she is a great mother and intelligent. She has a similar sense of humor to me, which is why we get along so well. She is the most beautiful woman that I've ever met. Tori is not only my wife, she is my best friend. Since we met, she has taken on quite a lot helping me with Taylor and Aubrey. And now we have a beautiful son together, and I can't thank you enough for everything that you do.
Tori, you and I have always been close, but I think over the past two years, we've gotten even closer as you moved home from, Ch or from Chicago to Champaign and started hanging out with me and Lucas and our friends, eventually Kirk. We all took a trip to Chicago for a Cubs game. Tori and Kirk started out the day as friends, but more acquaintances, but by the end of the day, Kirk was jumping into sweet Tori's arms, <laughs> and they were twirling down the streets of Wrigleyville together. <laughs> Kirk's brother. We've been brothers for as, uh, as long as I can remember. <laughs> you know, uh, for some reason he trusts me to do this. Yikes. Um, I'm not going to be embarrassing or anything. I'm going to keep this short and simple for me. Uh, no, honestly, it means a lot. Uh, growing up, Kirk and Dylan were a lot closer than than the three of us, so like, they always picked on me and messed with me, trapped me in the bathroom. Yeah, you know, big brother stuff. That's what every big brother does. But uh, no matter how much Kirk mess, would mess with me, I knew he would always have my back. He was always very protective of Dylan and I. We would, we would still have our arguments and whatnot, but like I said, when it comes down to it, he'd be there for me. So uh, thank you, Kurt. <laughs> 